Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today I have a collective message. We're going to find out what we want you to hear. Please remember this may not resonate for everyone. So let's get straight into this and find out what we want you to know. Okay, whoever I'm picking up on today, I'm getting a very unapproachable energy, okay? Like, I'm just getting this vibe of people view you as unapproachable, okay? Um, people think that, I don't know what this is, but I feel like people feel like that you're rude, okay, or you're mean, I just mean one, one, one. There's definitely a lot of judgment, okay? Um, I'm just getting this energy where people just feel like you're unapproachable. They're quite intimidated by your, your presence, okay? You may be physically attractive, okay? And that kind of get people and people again they feel like you're rude you're mean okay you're unapproachable but I am getting this energy okay where you are kind of cloned off okay and I'm getting that you're very selective with who you allow in your energy okay so again this may come off a little bit unapproachable to some people especially people that hold an energy that you don't really mess with and I just need to one two okay it's like if they have an energy that you're for example if you you know you don't you have strong boundaries when it comes to people being honest with you okay say that you know you don't like lions okay but there's somebody with you know, they will lie a lot, okay, or they just have this spirit where they're very deceptive, okay, then they may feel like you're very unapproachable, okay. There's a certain type of person that your energy attracts, okay, somebody that is very down-to-earth, very loyal, okay, somebody that is very honest as well, right, but I'm also just getting that you're very cloned off to lower vibrational people, okay? Some people view you as high maintenance, okay? Or somebody that has a lot of expectations, okay? And whether that's true or not, I'm just getting that you don't really associate with people that are not from your vibration okay or higher right like I am getting that you have a strong knowing that the people around you okay and their energy really affect the person that you are right for example if you hang around people that in their free time you know they want to drink okay um like drink alcohol okay like that's what they do for fun right then it's like you're going to end up lowering your vibration to that. But I am getting that you're somebody that you don't really entertain energy from a lower vibration, okay? You definitely surround yourself with people that are definitely business-minded, okay? People that have routines and people that are also very spiritual-minded, okay? Just people that really resonate with you. I am getting that, again, this may come off as an energy, not just unapproachable, but people from a lower vibration may feel like you're a snob or you think that you're better than them, right? 
when it's not that at all, you choose to surround yourself with people that, again, I am getting that you do not surround yourself with people that hold you back, okay? Whoever I'm picking up on, you are very sensitive to energy, right? And you have very strong boundaries, okay? And again, these boundaries are coming off as something where people feel like, again, you're rude, okay? I am getting a very unapologetic energy to you. Like, I mean, if you don't want to do something, you're not going to do it, right? You definitely have this um, strong main character energy. Okay, like an energy where you do not follow the crowd, okay, you do not care what other people think, you do not care what other people like or what other people are doing, you're not somebody that is following the trend, okay, you're somebody that knows your power, okay, very intelligent person, okay, very authentic in your own energy, um, you also have this uniqueness. Like, I'm getting that uh, you may actually, a lot of people may actually tell you that you're unique, okay? Or there's something about you that's different. You're not like other people, right? Um, and not in like a pick-me energy way, but then just an actual very unique energy to you. For some of you, you may have a very unique, like the way that you look may be very unique. Maybe you have... I'm picturing somebody with really beautiful green eyes right now, okay? Um, that may resonate for you, but I'm getting that there's a feature, okay? Whether it's on your face or on your body, there's something about you that is super unique and people can't really imitate it either, okay? And I'm getting that you really embrace this beautiful... It's like you're in your own energy, you embrace your energy, you're really good with energy, right? So, a lot of people, um, again, that this, it's like you draw a lot of people in, but there's this, um, fear okay people you may have a lot of people that just like stare at you okay say you walk into a room you may have a lot of people that are just like watching you looking at you um kind of admiring you i am getting that you have this energy where it's like you walk into the room and people just can't help but to like look at you okay again you are very physically attractive but I am getting that it's your energy, right? Because you are so, you are so embodied in your own energy that like the outer world does not affect you. It does not bother you, right? It's like you're living moment to moment, okay? You're not in your head, okay? You're just in your, in the moment, okay? Being very mindful of not really being mindful of your surroundings, but just being very in your own energy. Um, and I am getting this energy of that just drawn people in, really. You living your authentic energy, living in your authentic self, really drawn so many people in, right? And I'm getting that, it's like you walk into the room, people just... They're kind of like mesmerized by your beauty or just mesmerized by your presence, right? And again, you may not even have a lot of people approaching you because you come off unapproachable, right? Like you give off this energy where it's like, don't cross my boundary, okay? So especially people that don't have the confidence, okay, or they feel intimidated to approach you, um, those people, they're not resonating with you, right? I mean, only people on a very high vibration, okay, that 
have the same goal than you or they're somebody that could inspire you they're the type of people that do have the confidence to kind of approach you so you do have um you have two people here right that are very romantically interested in you okay both of the people too they are not on your level they feel like that they again you're giving off this very high maintenance energy um whether you're high maintenance or not these people both of these people do you have Okay, so you have two people. They both could be earth sign, okay? Um, heavy earth, okay? So Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. Um, both of these people are too intimidated to reach out to you. One of, okay. So one of the people here, um, there's like a lot of internal stuff going on, okay, with this person. Um, they feel like they're not good enough, right? They feel like the thing is about this person is they don't give up, okay? And it's really hard for this person to take a loss and accept it. This person is somebody that's very determined and they will just keep trying and trying until they succeed, right? But this person, they're going through a lot of internal conflict. Um, again, this, both of these people will not approach you, right? You even have people that you work with that... It's like when people have to reach out to you, it takes a lot, right? And I'm even getting like your friends and family members, okay? Like I'm just getting that... You give off this energy where people don't want to bother you, right? Like, people just assume that you are doing something and people don't want to bother you. It takes a lot of courage for people to actually reach out to you, okay? You may not understand this, right? You may not understand why, because I am getting that you're actually very down-to-earth, okay? You're very chill, um... You make people feel very comfortable. The thing is, you have very strong boundaries when it comes to who you interact with, okay? Um, you're big on energy, right? So you're not the type of person that's going to entertain energy. I just need 13, 13. You're not going to entertain energy that's going to slow you down, okay? Or you don't resonate with, or you're not somebody that's going to... If something doesn't feel good, okay, you're not going to go for it, okay? Or you're not going to hang around the person, right? So, for some of you, um, there is a need for you to take the lead. I keep hearing take the lead, right? Especially if there's a connection that, or somebody that you're interested in, right? The person that I'm picking up on today, again, you seem to be very attractive, okay? People will look at you and view you as very confident. I just need 1414. Um, there's a need for you to kind of, you definitely have this energy where. Whatever you want, you can have it, okay? So if there's something that you want, you just need to go for it, okay? Especially in if there's a connection, okay? Because I do see that there's somebody here that's literally trying to send you telepathic messages, okay? They're trying to 
um, get readings on you, right? Like they are just too scared to speak to you, but they really want to be around you. They're trying to figure this connection out, okay? Because again, you give off this very unapproachable energy where it's really hard for this person to just pick up the phone and message you, right? As I mentioned before, it's hard for people around you that have known you for years to pick up the phone and message you, right? Um, and it's just the energy that you give off, right? People love being around you, but you do have these strong boundaries that do come off as unapproachable, right? So... Whoever I'm picking up on today, you, it's time for you to literally go for what you want, okay? You also tend to be very in tune on an energetic level, like I'm just getting somebody that's extremely talented with energy, right? I just think 1555. Um... I am getting that if there's some type of connection that you're feeling on an intuitive level, okay, or if there's something that you intuitively feel like you want to do, literally just do it. Like, whoever I'm picking up on today, again, you can have what you want. Like, if there's a connection that you're stressing over, which I'm not really getting your stressing type, but I'm getting that there is a connection. There could be somebody that you're waiting on, okay, or somebody that, you know... Maybe you're attracted to, okay, but they're not really reaching out again because they're extremely intimidated. Um, yeah, you're, the ball is in your court. Literally, you can have what you want. Literally, you can message them right now and they're, they're down, right? Now, again, guys, it's not going to resonate for everyone, okay? Please, okay? If this is really not resonating with you on a soul level, then you might not want to do that. But if you know that this is for you and your intuition's been going off this whole time, um, please recognize your power. Like, I do see that you recognize that, but please recognize the impact that you have on people, okay? Um, you can have what you want. And this doesn't even have to be like a romantic thing. Even though I do see that there is a king of pentacles here, right? That is too scared to reach out. Okay, really like, and it's stressing them out, it's causing them a lot of conflict, okay. Um, this person is literally already yawn, they're just too intimidated to speak to you, okay. Um, I mean, for some of you, there may be a karmic. If there may be somebody in the way, okay, or a karmic or something. Um, and if I'm being honest, if you reached out to this person tomorrow, they drop whatever they're doing, okay. Again, not gonna resonate for everyone. But whoever I'm picking up on today, you are somebody that is very attractive, very unique, okay? Somebody that you just have this irreplaceable energy, right? But people in general are kind of intimidated by you, right? Scared to reach out to you. You're giving unapproachable. Um, there's this person in particular... At this current time, they're kind of settling for less. I hate to say it, okay? I hate to say it, but they're kind of settling for less, okay? Um, like, they wish they could be with you. Um, and, I mean, if it's somebody that you were interested in, because they do see that they, they're they here, um, as I mentioned, you need to make the first move. Unfortunately, like, I know, you know what I mean, but you need to make the first move, and why not? Like, you're powerful, um, so stand in your power, right? Now, I'm not encouraging you to make the first move if, you know, this is not resonating, okay? But again, if this is resonating for you, again, you can have what you want. The ball is in your court. This is your person. Um, they're kind of just waiting for things to fall into place. 
They don't have the courage to speak to you, right? That's what's going on here. There's Pisces energy here. Strong Earth energy here. Um, we got Scorpio energy here as well. So that's all I have for you. If it resonated, let me know. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video.